Get the brand new Dennis Backpack, now available at DennisDaily.com. Hey everybody and welcome to another video. Today, something very, very different. We're gonna be trying some Japanese candy. Not just this one, I got a whole bunch. I got some weird fish looking one, <laughs> not excited for that. Let's start with this one. It's interesting. So I obviously can't read Japanese. Um, this one has like a, oh, this one's a sucker. <gasps> so here's the thing, quick disclaimer. I actually don't like candy personally. I don't eat it. I don't really like sweet stuff, but this is interesting because I've never tried Japanese candy before. I've seen a lot of videos of other people like foreign foreign people to, to North America trying American candy. Candy. And it's really interesting seeing different cultures try different cultures stuff because then it's like sometimes they're really surprised by what we eat But it's like I'm gonna be really surprised by like like this for example Is this like a normal thing in Japan? Maybe you guys can let me know in the comments. It seems so interesting It's like it looks like fish. I think this is fish. They're like fish flavor. There's some form of like jerky, but it's fish I don't know. Let's start with this though. It's like some sort of sucker. Ah, okay Honestly, a little bit nervous. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. These have, uh, all right, hold on. We're supposed to open it this way. Very good, very good, yes. So, just like that. Oh, how satisfying. We can be, do like a little ASMR video. Oh, wow. Is it messy? It feels like a normal sucker. Ooh, and then we got the little, little candy in there. Not candy, but what is it? Just sugar? It is just straight up sugar. It doesn't smell like sugar. It smells like, uh, oh, are you supposed to? Oh, I see what you're supposed to do. If I, if I put, do, do that, okay. <laughs> I ripped the instructions in half, of course. So you first lick it and then you put it in the sugar, something like that. I, I don't know. We're gonna try that because right now, as you can see, let's get some sort of little focus on this. I don't know if the camera isn't very good at focusing. Oh my goodness, it might actually focus. Oh, <gasps> whoa, there you go. So it's, uh, you know, it's got, wow, that looks pretty cool. It's really like, it's really satisfying. I don't know, at least to me. All right, camera, let's focus again. Here we go. We're going to give it a little try. Hmm, hmm. Does the taste, is it supposed to come from this or from the sugar? Tastes pretty good. It's like, it tastes like, like a, like some sort of pop, some sort of soft drink maybe. You know what it kind of reminds me of? You know, there's like little metal looking Coke, like orbs that you eat. You eat it and you suck on it and it tastes like Coca-Cola. It's kind of like that. I'm trying to shove it in there so I can get more, with some more sugar. It's very difficult though. Okay, there we go. Oh, when you do another close up, there's going to be sugar everywhere. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm taking out a Kleenex. Oh, it looks so much more appetizing now. Check this out. Okay, hold on. Camera, now's your time to focus again. There we go. Oh man, look at that. Oh no, it's falling. It's okay. We're good. Man, that looks, that looks delicious actually. Here we go guys. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Mm. Ah, yes. Well, you know, not too bad. I kind of like it. I kind of want to keep sucking on it, honestly. This doesn't happen very often with candy. I'm usually just kind of done after a little bit. This is really good. Well, I'm gonna put that on the side. Not too bad, would recommend that one. Let's, let's do a little rating system here. Right here, I'm gonna be putting little ratings for each candy that I do. That one, I'm gonna say was a solid, that was an eight out of 10 candy right there. That was pretty good. I was, well, yeah, eight out of 10. That was solid, you know? I love fun candy, fun food in general. Whenever it's like there's some dipping involved and stuff, you can keep it fairly uh, fairly clean. Messiness is gonna be a big factor I'm gonna be accounting for in all these in all these candy tr trials because like, if I'm eating something and I know it's gonna be messy, it actually kind of turns me off from eating it. I'm not as excited to eat the like, those types of food unless they were uh, a little more you know more nice like like these ones for example we're like i feel like these ones aren't going to be messy i don't know what it is it's a little bunny right there not too sure what his deal is he's sleeping right now is that a blanket oh no it's a little bunny in a dress and then she's on strawberries that's actually adorable okay these are little it's really this is hard this is difficult oh life is so hard <laughs> here we go so there are these just little it's like little uh looks like us uh, the the little rockets you know whatever they're called the little things like the little sugar candy let's try it mm. oh whoa whoa oh whoa that just melts in your mouth it's gone as that and no 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 it's so weird it disappears instantly I'm not kidding. Like, I'm not exaggerating at all. I don't know if I can, like, like display it on my tongue. Uh, uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, <laughs> it's not gonna do anything. If I just suck on it, I mean, it sucks super hard, and it's gone. See? It is gone. It's just melted. That's crazy. And it tastes pretty good. It has a like artificial strawberry flavor, which is expected with the strawberries on the casing. I was not expecting that at all, but that was a very pleasant surprise. I'm gonna try one more, but this time I'm just gonna try biting straight into it. Not even gonna suck on it or anything. I'm just gonna go, mmm. Wow, and it's just instantly gone. Uh, that is not, is not anywhere there. That was nice. Let's give that one a rating. So that one, ladies and gentlemen, just to reiterate, is the uh, is a little bunny in a dress on some strawberries. I obviously can't read the name. Um, this one, this one I'm going to give. kind of want to give that one an eight, but I'm not locking that in yet. I'm going to give that a seven and a half. I'm gonna give it a seven and a half because it's not quite on the same level as the sucker. I really enjoyed the sucker for some reason. That one was like really good. I think it's like, I like that it disappears quickly in your mouth, but it kind of like takes away a little bit from the candy because then it's just instantly gone. I guess there is the fun in the fact that it disappears right away. That's just kind of fun in itself. I don't know, it's, it was good. It was really good. Seven and a half. I am very critical with these things. So I mean, it's just kind of just, yeah. Oh, whoa, okay, hold on. So yeah, wait, wait, what was I saying? I'm pretty critical with these things. So, and a half is like pretty decent uh this one though is like the exact same thing except it's a little bear with grapes and uh these are grape flavored i'm just gonna do one because i actually really don't like grape flavored candy and these i'm gonna assume are exactly the same it's literally like the exact same candy just a different flavor Ugh. You know what it kind of tastes like? It reminds me of like, picture a strand of grapes, so like, like a bundle of grapes, but then there's always that one like squishy one, that wrinkly squishy one that you're like, eh, no, like not that. You eat all the nice ones around it, but then you just leave that one at the end. If you ate one of those, that's what it would taste like. That's like a, mm, no, that was like a four out of 10. <laughs> The next one, ladies and gentlemen, is... What is this? I, I have no idea. Oh, it looks like... I think it's gonna be a sucker as well. I don't know. Yes, that is exactly what it is there, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Hmm. Oh, ew! Oh, grape flavored again. <laughs> no! Oh, there's not much to say about it. It's just a grape flavored sucker. Um, a lot of candies like this in America, so... Not really too, uh, not really too interesting. I'm gonna have to give that one, like, very average. It's just like a super average sucker, and it's like, just like a really normal flavor. It just tastes like any other grape flavor. So that's a 5 out of 10. That's a 5 out of 10. The reason the other ones were a 4 out of 10 is because it wasn't just a grape flavor, it was like a bad grape flavor, in my opinion. Okay. Oh, should we go with the fish or whatever whatever this is? I don't even know what it is. Maybe I'll figure it out what it is whenever I open it and smell it. Oh, I'm nervous. But it's so weird. If this is like a common thing, why should I be nervous about eating it? Maybe it isn't common in Japan, but maybe it is. How about let's, let's save that for last. Because this one looks really fun and happy, and so I, I kind of just want to do that one. This one, I really like the little characters on this. This is amazing. I would have to say... This is, it looks like a bundle of stuff. It's like, cause it's got a little swirly here and then some things. Let's just open it up and see. It's a little case. Do you guys remember Dunkaroos? Dunkaroos are the best. Oh, whoa. So it's like a, it's like a package. So you get this and then you have, you get a little spoon. Whoa. Okay. This is going to be, this is going to be hassle, honestly. <laughs> so you get two packets, three packets. You get three packets with this candy. You get this one, which feels like some sort of sugar. And then this one feels more like kind of rock candy. And then this one is starting to feel a little bit more sugary again. Okay. Is there instructions on this? Yes, there is. Oh, I see. So, okay, it's, it might be kind of hard to see in here. Let's see if we can focus on that. There is the, uh, the what you call it right here. You're supposed to put purple in first and then, oh, they actually, they number it. So it's purple in first, goes one. See, so even says the little one right there and then it goes three for that one. So where's two? So it's two there. And I just put them all in the same one. Oh no, but I put the rock candy in the other one. Oh, <gasps> wait, oh, you're supposed to put a little bit of water in there too. You're supposed to put water in there. Oh man, that is okay. And it makes it all, it makes it into like a thing. All right, okay, you know what, we'll do that. We'll do that guys. So I'll first put in this one. Eh. Oh man, it's getting powdery. All right, putting that in eh, just like that. 
and then we're putting in a number two. You guys, will, like, right now, just to show you what it is, it's literally just like, I'm just pouring it into this thing. Nothing, nothing really interesting yet. So I supposed to put both of them in and then put water in? I think I read the instructions wrong. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Supposed to put a little bit of water. That's okay. I can probably just put in water now. Uh, we will be, we'll be right back. A few moments later. So I have absolutely no idea if I did this right because I can't read Japanese, but it's turning into some sort of weird, like, I mean, you guys can't really see. Here we go. It's turning into some weird, like, like yogurt substance. It's weird. It's almost like soapy. I feel like that's what it was supposed to be, though. Like, it kind of seems right. I have that now, and then I take this candy and. I dump it, so it's the little, ooh, it's these colorful little, okay, I'll show you guys. It's these colorful little, like, raw, it's colorful little rock candy. So, I take this, this, like, soap, dip it into the rock candy, and then it makes this cool little contraption there. I don't know, you guys, it's kind of hard to see just because of how, like, bright it is. You see what I mean, though? You take the soap, and then there's some rock candy in there, and then we simply eat. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. It's not very good. I mean, it's like, pretty good. Is it though? A little bit of preparation for that one. But in the end, I can totally be something really, really fun for just like kids to enjoy. I can't imagine being very mobile with that. That's never a candy I would bring with me to just like enjoy at a bus stop or something. It was not too bad though, you know? It was interesting. I'm glad I tried it. Honestly, I kind of want more. It was pretty good. And that one's fun too. That's an eight and a half out of 10 right there, guys. I'm putting it down, it's an eight and a half. Cause it's fun, it tasted good, it's interesting, it's unique. But now, whew, okay. I don't know if this is fish, or if this is jerky, or if this is fish jerky. Huh, I'm gonna open it, I'm gonna hope that it doesn't smell very strong. It smells incredibly strong, okay. Oh boy. What is that? There it is, guys, just to give you a little close-up. It looks like bark. It smells heavily of fish. It just straight up smells like fish skin. Very, very fishy flavor. It's like raw fish. I feel like it is raw fish, but then it's made into jerky. Oh, okay, well, I should probably clear out my mouth of all the really tasty candy. Here we go, guys. Fish jerky. Nope. <laughs> no. Bad, 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 bad. Oh, I need some of this candy to, 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 to fix what just happened. Oh, no. All right. Well, oh, no. It just got everywhere. If I stand up, there's going to be rock candy everywhere. <laughs> and I love sushi. Sushi's like literally one of my favorite foods. But that fish jerky was just not good. Um, what did it taste like? It tasted like I was eating, I was given a fish dish, like some sort of dinner that included like, maybe like some sort of fish filet. And then I take a bite out of the fish and it tastes like it's a part of the fish that shouldn't have been there. That's what that tastes like. It's like fish that I'm not supposed to be eating and it's like soaked in some sort of soy sauce or maybe probably not soy sauce, but you know, some sort of like very like dense tasting sauce. Mm. Yeah, no, not a fan. Uh, that's gonna have to be a three and a half. Three and a half. Three. We're, we're giving it a three out of 10. Not for me. I can see the appeal. I get why it's a thing. Not for me at all. I had to fix the taste that was left in my mouth with the candy that I rated the highest in today's episode of trying Japanese candy. Not that, that would, <laughs> did that just imply that I'm gonna be having many episodes of trying Japanese candy? I mean, I don't know if you guys love it. If you guys are like, wow, that is all I want to see now is you eating Japanese candy. Well, I guess maybe that might become a thing. I, I don't know. You guys need to let me know in the comments below. But actually, you know, let me know. Yeah, you, you guys enjoying these different types of videos? You know, a little bit of a, a little different than Roblox. I'm still doing Roblox. Don't worry, guys. It's okay. Roblox isn't going anywhere. But I just thought I'd try something new. And uh, that was fun. That was really fun. I'd like to do more stuff like that. So, but you guys gotta let me know because it's up to you guys. Other than that, though, ladies and gentlemen, 
I, I'd like to thank you so much for joining me for another video. If you enjoyed, please do remember to leave the video a like, maybe even subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Just go ahead and hit that big juicy subscribe button. It helps me out so much. Please, please, please. Oh, you don't have to. It's okay. I'm not forcing you or anything. It's just like, if you want to, it's right there, right below the screen, right below the video, unless you're full screen. Okay, let's, let's, let's wrap it up. Ladies and gentlemen, again, I'd like to thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.